Bureau towards the end of last week saying that anti-competitive practices in the tech sector would be a key priority for 2021. If you add in the People's Daily commentary criticising the business model of May 20 Jinping, and now, as you say, these retroactive actions against Alibaba and this unit of Tencent, then it certainly is fueling fears here that certainly big tech is in focus and the crackdown and the tightening of the noose will continue specifically into next year. So in terms of the details of this action from the regulators, the fines themselves, no big deal for Alibaba. You're talking 76,000 uh, US dollars. That is a drop in the proverbial ocean. They are looking, though, and they're concerned, the regulators, uh, at what they say was Alibaba's failure to seek approval before increasing its stake in a department store in China. Again, this is retroactive. This is back in 2017, this deal. China Literature, that unit of Tencent, it was spun off by Tencent. It's an e-business, an e-books business. Uh, that was also fined 76,000 uh, US dollars or thereabouts uh, for a previous deal as well. Again, failing uh, to seek approval is according to uh, China's regulators. They also said, by the way, that they are currently reviewing a proposed merger of those.